Good morning. Yeah, we uh, just got word of that arrest, and really a lot of people in this area are on edge following the 10 freeway fire. People know that that's very close uh, to this area, and then you have this morning four fires that were set in a very short period of time. Again, this particular arsonist, a suspected arsonist, has been arrested. I'll show you where one of the spot fires was set. This was set about 7.30 this morning. We did get a uh, talk to one of the residents here. You see the flames shot up, and there's a home there with some wood eaves. He's really concerned. That He told me that he, he heard some crackling, ran outside, saw some flames, and then broke out a garden hose and put it out before firefighters arrived. Listen. I'm thinking, no, it's the arsonist who did the 10 freeway. You know what I mean? I got enough traffic there. I don't want my house burning down, too. And now I'm waking up to this, like, kind of nightmare. And it's, you know what I mean? It's pretty scary. Uh, but, yeah, the house, I got the dog. I got my, my girl. Uh, she, she's pregnant. So it's like, you know, a lot of things. It's like trying to move real fast. But it's like you don't really have as much time as you think. Waking up to a fire is way different than waking up to an earthquake or, you know, some rainstorm. Showing you pictures from Sky Fox, several different scenes, four spot fires set mostly along Cesar Chavez Boulevard around 7 to 7.30 this morning, about four blocks apart. Other witnesses told police about the suspect they described as a Hispanic man with tattoos on his face, riding a bicycle. As you heard that neighbor say, a lot of people here just on edge following that pallet fire on the 10 freeway. No indications at all that these were connected at all, but nonetheless, neighbors uh, were on edge this morning, and we now know that the suspect has been arrested. That's the very latest from Boyle Heights. Bob DeCastro, we'll send it back to you. All right, Bob, thank you.